Hello my little cops of corn die here and welcome back to another episode of Maze. We are continuing on from our last episode looking for Bob's secret spot and discovering more of this underground facility. I think the screwdriver needs to get used on that inconspicuous spot that was way down here. Um, I think my etch -a sketch needs to get used over here so we're gonna go do Bob's face because I was able to click on this portrait earlier. Yeah, horribly sketched face. This terrible effort pretty much confirms that you will never, ever, ever have a career in drawing portraits. Your dreams have been shattered. I don't know, it looks like a similar likeness to him. <laughs> it's probably as good as I was gonna get it in a fucking etch -a sketch We are holding on to a lot of items right now. I'm gonna take this, what is this? A circuit board of RAM. Look at all this RAM. It has to be at least six, maybe seven bytes of RAM. You figure that's the most bytes in any bit of RAM ever and search for a computer upgrade with it, knowing not the slightest idea of how to do so properly. <laughs> nice. Okay. Uh, hiya, Ted. Just a heads up, I put your RAM right here. This way it gets less dusty. <laughs> oh my fucking god, Bob. You are the literal worst. I wouldn't be surprised if Ted killed Bob. Like, I would not be shocked at all by that. So I think we can put the backpack here. Uh, our Gripatron goes here. I'm not really... I'm not really sure about this. Alright, well, I mean, we still have this thing. Computer. Ugh, do I have to put the... Are you serious? <laughs> Massive error was, has occurred now in the computer. What, is, what does this say? Employing the angry caveman style of upgrading a computer, you have somehow, against all odds, succeeded in making the computer better and much less aerodynamic. <laughs> okay, um, is that this? Oh! What? What are you looking at? Something on Vladdy's face? Why you not talk? Do you understand? Yeah. Understand I what un Vladdy I is saying. I understand what you're saying, Vladdy. <sighs> Butso boy, you're a big idiot. How you survive by being stupid? <laughs> you're mean. <sighs> Fine. Vladdy, help. <sighs> You're gonna help me? No. What? How did you even come Oi, guys, to life? So huh? What is this on Vladdy's back? It's a Gripatron. This makes no sense. What? It does a grip? All of this is very stupid. It is very stupid. I, I will agree. <sighs> so, I mean, you're a talking go? teddy bear. <laughs> you have acquired Vladdy. Prepare to be insulted forever. Oh, okay. Well, can I give you this ready headband? No? Alright. Oh! Oh! We Another need cut you scene? to settle a debate on taking naps. Oh my god! What is that? That's my what teddy is, bear Vladdy. What is Plant saying? Is that a... It is. It's a helicopter! Is that a helicopter? Da? Give me a ride, Mr. Helicopter! No! Give me a ride! We can all fit <laughs> just climbing! What is my this? lucid what drug! Is this What's the way? Boy, Grisomignoy! My bear's Titania yelling Vesela. in Russian? Oh a my gosh. Contraption! What if you're just gonna be like that? <laughs> oh my god, the three. Where'd you guys oh, go? Right. Oh. We completely forgot. We have a message for you. It's you very important. For me? You should hit the showers. What's a shower? I have no idea. Hit the showers. Vladdy does not like it here. I'm I'm sorry, Vladdy. What do you want me to do about it? I didn't tell the corn to come. The corn just came. <laughs> What's in the? Oh, it's open now. Enter the ducks. Um, Vladdy, stay here while you do your stupid things. Okay, Idiot. you stay there then. Do I need to follow the the red line? All right, I'll. I'll follow it. That's a dead end. Oh, it, there's a yellow line. Do I follow the red one or go down the yellow? Let's go down the yellow line. Maybe this is... What's this? It should be me! It should oh. be me! What? Whoa! Surrounded by idiots! Rattle! 
Underappreciated. Ridiculed. <gasps> scorned. Whoa. Really, what is Who that? Who the fuck is this, this dude? not a number. What? Why is that there? We should have kept one around to ask about that. Exes. Ugh. Ridiculous. X is not a number. Oh my god. Oh no, did he just erase the board? Hmm, much better. Some of my best work. Was it saying something? Whoa. What was this... I doing? Ah oh, yes! Dealing with unwanted guests. Whoa. Wait, am I the unwanted guest? Oh. What? What did he just... Did he just come back in here and knock over that bottle? He seems nice. Yeah, <laughs> okay, well, uh, I guess we'll just um, continue on down this way. I really appreciate how the music has changed in the uh, underground facility than from the farmhouse, because when we were in the farmhouse, it was like an eerie, creepy music. And now it's like a suspenseful music. Oh, where did that dude it again. go? Where did what go? Not here. Ha! Not here. So insulting! How dare it! This oh. insolence will not be tolerated! Insolence. This one is dangerous. Not like the others. I can see it already. This one has a brain. Hmm, must be dealt with. I'm so confused right now. Oh! Did he just... What's he gonna <laughs> draw this time? <laughs> did he draw himself? Is that... Oh, what? <laughs> he came back in and knocked over the little bottle, like in the first one. He's probably talking about you. Is he saying that I have a brain? Hmm. Oh, gotta go down now. Oh. Ooh, is this the Ruby Queen? This one's definitely female. It's a little creepy. We're watching her sleep though. Who has disturbed me? What? Whoa. We are not amused that you have kept us waiting. What? As our servant informed you of your task. What? No. Of course not. What? Insult. I am so confused No matter. Right now. One must do things themselves if one would like it done right. What's this bitch's like problem? Feels trapped here for an age. Our cowardly captors saw to that by stopping the righteous light from bathing us in its glory. Oh, is she talking about the sun? Of course. We would not expect one such as yourself to understand. <laughs> Why? But perhaps you are different from the rest. I sure am. ourselves hope. What? That we have finally found our champion. Oh, that's me. I'm your champion, bitch. No, likely not. What? For sure I am. But we would be remiss if we did not at least let you attempt to do something of value. So, we bequeath to you your tasks. Restore energy to this wretched place once again. And raise the rings. Only then will you be worthy of consideration. Consideration of what? Who's we? Man, this chick... Looks like you have something to do. In pure coincidence, a new path has opened to you. Head to the West Hook checkpoint. The fuck is the West Hook checkpoint? Ah, idiot. So you are what? done being stupid up there. I wasn't Good. being stupid in there. there I was go. getting our mission. Shut up, you stupid bear. You're mean. We gotta find the West Hook, Vladdy. Where do you think the West Hook is? What's this? Is this it? The West Hook Checkpoint! Yay, we found it, Vladdy! Good for us! Even though you're... Oh, there you are. You weren't behind me. <laughs> uh, what's what? this? Why is that Vladdy's job? What Ask is Vladdy to supposed to do? Council. I don't know, Vladdy! It's fucking telling me to tell you to do it! So just get your little bear ass over here and fix the machine this with your little thing will grabby never thing. Work. It is... What? Huh? Really? Okay. You kicked it? Facial recognition security checkpoint. Oh, come on! Okay, are ho horribly... There's the face. Oh my god. No, this is not gonna work. This is not going to work. 
Oh my god. Let's press the button. You must be joking. That never worked. It <laughs> apparently it well, did. That was still stupid. It is stupid. I agree with you. I agree with you full on, Vladdy. Alright, what do we have here? Heavy door. Hey, look, you opened the door. Woo wee! Um, alright, well, let's go. Let's go, uh. I don't know, let's go up here. Through these creepy stairs. That's not, uh, not an issue at all. I don't mind. Sure as. I feel like we walked up way more stairs than we walked down. Uh oh, where the, f where the fuck are we? Hiya, Ted. Since it's a highly sensitive area, I added a new security door. No need to thank me. Can't be too careful. Bob. <laughs> oh, fuck. Bob, do you realize that your new security door closes for no reason and locks people inside this very secure area? Stop being cheap and get a door that works, moron. <laughs> Uh-oh. I feel like this door is going to close on us. Yeah, it probably is. Which means if we don't want to be in here, but I mean, there's stuff. There's stuff. No! Ah. Stupid American garbage. Stupid American garbage is right. Now we're in here. All right, so we picked up a sub manual. An instruction manual for building your very own two-man submarine. Since Bob and Ted opted for the budget model, the manual is 800 pages long and mapped out in a fashion that is similar to a choose-your-own-adventure novel. Oh my gosh. Way to go, Bob. You decided to pick this up because you like the direction of the grain in the wood and that it gives you splinters while holding it from every conceivable angle. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly why I picked it up because I love getting splinters. This magic water pipe grants you the power to transport water from one end of it to the other. There is no reason for you to do this at any point in the adventure, but you will continue to carry it anyway, just in case. <laughs> Okay, what do we have here? We got a little key. Hiya, Ted. Just FYI, I brought the acetine gas tank up to the farm for the annual staff barbecue. Completely corn-free, of course. Haha, <laughs> Bob. Oh my god, that's <laughs> the trail detractor. I commented on that in a previous in in our previous video and uh, about how unsafe I thought that that was. <laughs> <laughs> How many times have I told you that we can't have barbecues on the farm? Put it back. We're days behind schedule and stop joyriding with the tractor dummy. <laughs> oh, oh, Ted. Oh, I, okay, so I have to find an item. We have a key here. Created by Pete's and Games Carnival, the design of the loading crane appears to be based off a simple claw game, a fact that excited Bob to no end. Ted, conversely, wasn't too thrilled about it, but stuck with it anyways after Bob forged his signature on the approval form. Of course he did. <laughs> what? Why do we have this crane? Oh, Ted. Great. Water. Bloody's favorite. Hiya, Ted. I upgraded the lifting system so two people could use it at once. Our efficiency will be nearly double. Oh, no. Bob, know that I do not say this lately, but this may well be the absolute worst idea you've ever had, idiot. <laughs> oh look, we found another uh, another thing. Can I get into the water? Nope, can't get in the water. Another wrapper. Oh, we got a, a cello box. What's this? Locked. Okay, well I can't use the key in this. Bob, for the last time, stop leaving your junk everywhere. I don't know why you even have a cello case. You don't even own a cello, dummy. <laughs> oh no, what the hell, Bob? Hey, Ted, need this box of knickknacks loaded? Be a pal and move it for me, would you? Oh god. Bob, you sloth, I'm not your errand boy. Load it yourself. So now we have a straight. Okay. I believe this key needs to get used in the tiny toolkit over here. Oh yeah, got a box cutter and a hammer. The cheapest box cutter commercially available, this brand holds the distinction of being the only one that is rendered completely useless after one swipe. That is a, an amazing box cutter. 
What's this hammer say? For some reason, you feel the urge to bring something beautiful with this instead of doing the standard task of hammering a nail. You don't know why you think these things. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, well, um, I'm assuming the box cutter is going to be used on the box. That's just my opinion. Why well, you pick up what so much this? garbage, idiot? Bloody does a not Fabergé egg? Oh my gosh. Bob got his hands on these extravagant artifacts because he knew a guy and bought them in bulk so he could get a slight discount. He kept them even after he learned that they didn't contain any chocolates. Oh no. That's, uh, okay. Well, I'm thinking I need to break the egg with the hammer. Fabergé eggs are really beautiful. And this, this, this almost pains me a little. And inside it, I have a priceless lockpick. Easily the most expensive lockpick in the world, but you don't really care because you have no idea how modern economics work. <laughs> All right, and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna use the lockpick over here on the cello. And what the fuck is this? A nuclear fuel rod? For reasons known only to you, you are holding a very radioactive fuel rod in your hands, ignoring every known safety procedure for proper containment and storage imaginable. Oh my god, Bob. You, you would. Bob totally would. This would be something, I'm not even shocked. This is totally something that Bob would do. Now, I guess the only question that I would have would be... How do we get out? Oh, from here? Uh, in there? What? Oh, butzel boy. Oh. Oh, God. Stupid idiot. Making Vladdy crawl through dumb thing. What? what? Is I didn't complain when I had to Stupid. crawl through shit. Whoa. Oh, stupid wires everywhere. Oh, no. Why is this stupid? Oh! Oh. Ah, ah, why is this stupid thing upside down? Makes no sense. What upside How down? How stupid are these idiots? Maybe a Vladdy gets. Oh, oh shit! Ah, Vladdy has to. Oh, ah, yes, do this stuff. Ah, ah, boy, guy, so many. Oh. Hey, thanks, Vladdy. You opened the door. Hey, idiot! Did that work? Yep. Stop being stupid and say something. Yep. Fine. Vladdy done anyway. Okay. Do we more Lucy drugs? Stupid idiot. Could get nowhere without Vladdy. Vladdy has to do everything. Wait, you've done one so, thing, two no things. What? You've done two things, bro. You've opened this door for me twice. Actually, it wasn't even that door. It was, you opened that door for me once, and you opened some other door for me once. You've opened two doors for me, bro. I've done a lot of shit. Alright guys, well I think we're gonna end our episode here. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like this video, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think we're gonna be doing with this fuel rod. <laughs> this fuel rod looks like uh, it's gonna be a little fun. Why the fuck Bob put it in a cello case? I have no idea. But I look forward to finding that out with you guys in our next one.